this was my first little item. It cost two and a half P and I just fell in love with it. You wouldn't believe that so much could come from that one little thing. How many things do you think you have, Royal, if you could put a number on it? Well, I would think something like 12, 13,000. I've got a big uh, china collection. I've got, they're all mugs, plates, saucers, cups, everything like that. Um, I've got dresses, but if it interests me, I will buy it. I wouldn't buy anything that was really ugly. Um, I just, I just enjoy it, you know. It grows all the time, you know, especially with things like this. My parents were great royalists. And when you're an only child, you pick up on adults more because you're with adults more, you know. When I was 19, I came to London and obviously there were more um, hope of seeing a member of the royal family. I mean, Herefordshire is just fields and cows and sheep and things like that. You don't get that down there, but up here you were in with a good chance. So I love that. I always loved London. What's your first major memory of a royal occasion? Uh, the royal event would actually be the, cor the coronation. Because we didn't have a television, we didn't watch it on the day, but then we had a fete. They did a fete for us, and that was great fun. It was, uh, you know, in a big area, and um, we all got our new dresses on and everything like that. So that was lovely. I met the Queen on four occasions. Oh, it was fantastic. I got to see her, I gave her uh, flowers. Um, she thanked me very much. She was very charming when I met her. This is one of my newest items for this Jubilee. Um, it's called a charger. I thought it was beautiful. It's just got a charm about it, so I was very happy with it. I think Her Majesty the Queen is just brilliant. I think she's there for us all the time. When there's anything very sad, anything that she should be there, she's there. And she cares about us. I just hope she's happy.